<laughs> Not a common name. No, <laughs> don't name yourself Ninja. No, no grandma name. All my follower is young and beautiful. Give them a better one. No Felicia. No Karen. <laughs> what about Ginger? How about garlic? Ginger? Ginger's your name. Really? Yeah. Hi. We are here to help you pick an English name, like I promised from my previous video. I also got my best friend, ChatGPT, <laughs> to help us. If Nate couldn't come up with a good name, I'll ask ChatGPT. Here's a sound alike English name. Here's what your Chinese name sounds like in English. Let's get started. First platform, let's start from Bilibili, Yan Yan. Yan Yan? Yan Yan. Yan Yan. That one's hard. There are not a lot of English names that start with Y. Maybe like, you could do something like Annie. A N N I E. Ask ChatGPT. Yanny. It's not a real name. Why is not? Yanny? Yanny is a real name. Uh, let's see. Yanny, remember the challenge? Is that Yanny or Laura? Laurel. 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 Wenjun. The current English name is Wella. Well, it's good. I, it, the name sounded to me like Wendy. W-E-N-D-Y. Okay, Wendy, which is a fast food brand as well. It's also a fast food brand. No, that's Wendy, so it's different. But, okay, next one. Fulin. Filene. F-I-L-E-N-E. -E. Felicity. Felicity. Okay, Felicity is another one. Or Fiona. Fiona doesn't have L. Or... Felicia, different spelling. You don't like that. No more Felicia. Yeah, no more Felicia. No Felicia. Bye Felicia. Bye Felicia. Wei Wei. Wei Wei. She said her current name is Vivian, but she doesn't know if that's good enough. Vivian's a good name. Vivian? Yeah. Wei Wei, do you have another? Wei Wei doesn't sound to me like any other English name, but. Vivian is close to it. Sometimes W's can sound like V's. So it's yeah. like VV. Vivian for short could be Vivi or Viv. Viv. Ooh, next one. Suqi. Suqi sounds like CC. C E C E maybe? CC. CC. Or S I S S I E. That sounds nice. Next one. Hui Niao. Uh, you can go with a W, like. Something like Winnie. Winnie the Pooh? <laughs> like Winnie the Pooh, yeah. Is that girl's name or boy's name? It's a girl's name. It became popular again just recently. Oh, so okay. 2019. Before okay. that, it was popular in the 1940s. Okay, good news, Hui Niao. Winnie, if you choose Winnie, it's become trendy right now. Okay, next platform, let's check my Xiaohongshu, little red book. Zhong Qiao. So Zhong, in English, sounds like the J sound. So I'm looking for something that starts with a J. How about Jolene? <laughs> <laughs> Name of a famous song. Jolene, Jolene, Jolene. I don't know how to sing that song. Jolene, 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 Jolene. Yi Jun Xuan. Yi Jun. Um, just something like June. June is a more common name now. J U N E. It's like the month. Yeah. If you're born on June, then that's the name for you. How about Queenie? So you know somebody named Queenie, but I don't think I've ever heard. Yeah, I know just one girl and she's from China too. Yeah, I don't think I've ever heard the name Queenie. No, let's check if Queenie is a thing. Is that a made up name or is a name name? Oh, to answer your question, Queenie is a name. Qin Xiao Wen. Well, you can start from Xiao Wen. Yeah, I'm trying. So, like, Shawna, maybe? S H A W N A? Zhu or Zhu? Meng Jun. Girl's name. I would say Monica. Meng Jun? Monica? Margo. Margo, yeah. Margo is a girl's name. The name of a character in. For all mankind. Zhi le. Oh, I hope you guys comment in Chinese. 
You guys know that I can read Chinese, right? <laughs> zhi le, zhi, zhi. Julie. Julie. Angela Julie. Jolie. Jolie. Julie. Jolie. Julie. You can do Jolie. Julie. Julia. Yeah. Juliet. Guo Lang Xing. It's a boy's name. Guo Lang Xing. Sounds like Gavin to me. G A V I N. By the way, the <laughs> governor in California's name is Gavin Newsom. So Gavin could be a very powerful name. Gavin. Shang Yu Ru. Oh, wow. I like your Chinese name, by the way. Yeah, we get a lot of SH names. Um, yeah, there's a lot, lot of SH sound in Chinese. Maybe like Shelly, S-H-E-L-L-Y. Shelly. Okay, Chinese name Wang Meng Yuan. Put the family name away. Just think about the first name, Meng Yuan. Meng. I mean, it sounds like Morgan to me. Morgan? Do you like Morgan? I hope you like Morgan. Okay, next one. Uh, Lilia. Do you think that's a name in English? Uh, it wouldn't be common. Lily is common, so with no A at the end. Lillian is a name or Lily? L-I-L-L-I-A-N. Liu Rui Xi. Baby girl, Liu Rui Xi. So it sounds like Lori. Lori. L-O-R-I. Actually, I like it. Xin Rong. She used to name herself Sharon. 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 Is that a? Not a common name. What's your advice for Xin Rong? I think you could do Shira. S H I R A. Okay. Xin Yue. It's like you. I know. You could do like Shannon, Charlene, maybe, or Sharon, or Sharona. So what's it, what, give, give her ultimate one name. I would go with, with Sharon. S-H-A-R-O-N. Yeah. My English is the English language. L-Y-N. Lin? Usually spelled L-Y-N-N. So it's okay to have L-Y-N, right? Yeah, I think people might think that there's a spelling mistake. Up to you if you want to add Another N under your current name that become a very common name, Lin, right? Yeah. Amelia. Amelia is a name. Yeah. How about that name? It's a good name. Okay. Percy. Not con. It's a little bit old-fashioned. I think of it as a boy's name, a little bit of an old-fashioned boy's name. But a lot of names in English can be start as boys' names and then become girls' names. Like Jackie. So it's okay. Percy, keep using Percy. It's okay. Shi Qi. Shi Qi. I hope it's not Lansky. <laughs> what about Charlie, which is often a boy's name? A boy's name, name. But can also be a girl's name. Give me another one. Chloe. Chloe is a good name. It doesn't sound like Shi Qi at all. This is better. Chelsea. Shi Qi. Chelsea. Yeah. Sounds. Not exactly the same. Uh, a little bit of similarity there if you really think about it. Shi Qi, Chelsea. All right. This girl, her family name is Wang and uh, she has a name, Yu. Like rain. Yu. Yu. It's hard because it's not that common for English names start with Y. Or W. Well, we know a girl named Yell. Y A E L. Xin Yi. Oh my God! What? <laughs> That's my name. If you don't want to take Shayna, you can think about Sydney. Right? Sydney is a name. Yeah, we were also suggesting Cheyenne. Cheyenne, Sydney, Yulin. Uh, like Eileen. Yeah, Eileen Gu. Come on, that's a good name. Xue Qi. How about Susie. Susie. Yeah, we know a girl named Susie and she's pretty. Just one word, Shu. Just Su, S-U-E. It's okay, short Su. for Susan. Zhu Zhexi. Jessie. Zhu Zhexi, Jessie. Yeah, Jessie is a nice one. Kong Li Na. Colleen, C-O-L-L-E-E-N. Ke Xin. So Ke Xin, I think sounds like Christine. 
Christine. That's a great one. Christine, 颗星 Christine, yes. Go, Christine. How about Tang Xiaofeng? Xiaofeng, Tang, ChatGPT, Tiffany. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> Tiffany. <laughs> Tiffany, Tang Xiaofeng, Tiffany. Oh my God, such a classy name. Next platform, my Douyin, Zuo Yun, Jia. Say it again. Zuo. <laughs> Because it's pinging, you know, I don't know the intonation. What about ginger? How about garlic? Ginger. Ginger's a name. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah. Ginger is a girl's name. Can you believe that? <laughs> Somebody comment this ninja. Ninja. <laughs> Not a common name. No. <laughs> don't name yourself ninja. Zhang Dan Dan. Dan Dan. I mean Danielle. Daniela. Or Daniela. Okay, Daniela is a common girl's name. All right, I think we go through everything. <laughs> Yay! Yay! I hope you guys like the English name. We suggest, not give. We just suggesting, so you can take it or leave it. What's your best advice for people picking an English name? I think you want. You want a name that sounds like a name in English. You can pick a name that someone else already has. It's okay to have the same name as other people. I know in Chinese culture we don't want to have the same name with other people. I totally get it. It's better to have an appropriate name than have a self-made weird name that nobody know how to pronounce it. Does that make sense? I agree. Don't make up a name. If you made a name, then why why don't you just keep your Chinese name, right? So you just te teach other people how to pronounce your real Chinese name, and that's okay. That's totally fine. You don't have to think about the meaning too much. I'm not saying that just don't care about the meaning. I'm saying that you want to have an appropriate name first, then think about the meaning behind. I agree. <laughs> All right. This is today's video. I hope. You find it helpful. If you have any other question, please comment below. And also, have fun, shop around. And I hope you will get a perfect English name for yourself eventually. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye bye.